Welcome, welcome everyone to my new Beyond the Womanist Classroom Podcast. I am your host, Dr. Mitzi J. Smith. I am a biblical scholar trained at Howard University School of Divinity and at Harvard University. I am currently the J. Davison Phillips Professor of New Testament at Columbia Theological Seminary here in Decatur, Georgia. I am the co-author. I am the author, co-author, or editor of nine books, including Womanist, Sass, and Talk Back, Social Injustice, Intersectionality, and Biblical Interpretation. You can find that book on Amazon.com or at Cascade Books. I started this podcast because I wanted to explore how I could create a bridge between the hermeneutical practices and theories introduced in my womanist and feminist courses and the life and ministry of students beyond or outside of the classroom. I am so glad that you decided to join me in watching my trailer today. This Beyond the Womanist Classroom podcast offers a dedicated space for ongoing dialogue, consciousness raising, critical thinking, and risk taking. This podcast is meant to be a brave space and a co-transformational space. As a co-transformational space, together we commit to dialogue and the practice of biblical interpretation that centers Blackness, Black women, Black communities, and that prioritizes the justice that we need and or the world in front of the biblical text where we struggle to survive and thrive and experience and practice our faith in an all loving just God. It is a space where we learn to take hermeneutical risks build confidence in our ability, in our agency to interpret text, and find and or sharpen, because we are always sharpening our voices in opposition to injustice and violence wherever it is situated or housed, be that in a sacred text or in the world in which we live. In this podcast, we consider all things womanism, biblical interpretation, and justice. So that you know what to expect, future podcasts will include, among other things, but not limited to these topics, Womanism and the Bible as a Human Text, Womanism and Contextual Justice, the importance of our questions, Dobbs v. Jackson in conversation with Rachel, the inconsolable Rachel in Matthew, the Bible as a collection of testimonies, and to join me for one of those episodes, we I have my former professor from Howard University School of Divinity, Dr. Michael Newhart, joins me for one of those conversations. 
We will discuss, because you asked us to, sex, sexuality, and sin. We probably would have discussed it anyway. We will discuss gender, power, and authority. That's one of your topics as well. Civic responsibility and dissent, especially as we enter or as this, we go, draw closer uh, to the privilege and responsibility we have as voters. These and other topics we will discuss. Our first full podcast episode drops this coming Friday, September 2nd. We are so excited. I am so blessed you will find joining me uh, on this journey a longtime friend and longtime public school educator, Miss Rebecca Christian. She will join me in many of my conversations. Here is what we would like for you to do. Please follow us. Uh, and at our new Twitter uh, account, at spelled out beyond, B-E-Y-O-N-D, capital T, capital W-C. That is at beyond, capital T, capital W, capital C, beyond the womanist classroom. And if you hear something on one of our podcasts or all of our podcasts that resonates with you, Please hashtag BTW Womanist, capital C. Hashtag capital B, capital T, capital W Womanist, capital C. Join us as well, particularly if you are a former student or very serious about participating in this podcast, offering your suggestions and topics. Join us, and if you are interested in continuing the conversation beyond the episodes, join us in our private Facebook group, Beyond the Womanist Classroom. There, as stated, we will continue this conversations, our conversations, seek feedback, Take your feedback seriously. Many of you already gave feedback on um, the um, on our logo and our cover photo. Ask your questions. No question is a bad question. And share your ideas there about future podcasts. I am so grateful to the Wabash Center for Teaching and Learning in Theology and Religion, whose fabulous director is Dr. Lynn Westfield. I'm grateful to her and her colleagues there for their support through a small grant that seeded the creation of this podcast. Thank you so much once again for joining me here today in this space. And I look forward to seeing you soon in our very first podcast and in our Facebook group. Have a fabulous, wonderful, blessed day.